think it's murder. I mean, clearly it's murder. What can I do to help? Yeah, that's me. But February, I mean, that was months ago. What's that got to do with Simon's murder? I didn't murder Simon. You've got it wrong. You've got the wrong person. I'd like to speak to a lawyer now. You have no murder weapon. You have nothing. And all these stories we've been telling each other. Just that. Stories.
I'd like to speak to a lawyer now. Stop that. Just that. I didn't murder Simon. You've got it wrong. You've got the wrong person. I didn't murder Simon. I'd like to speak to a lawyer now. I'd like to speak to a lawyer now. You think it's murder? I mean, clearly it's murder. What can I do to help? Yeah, that's me. But, February, I mean... Simon, Simon Smith. He works at Ernst Brothers Glass. They do windows, all kinds of glass. Simon does the more special work, mirror making, feature windows, artistic things, really beautiful things. Simon, Simon Smith. He works at. Um, Simon is six foot, darkish blonde hair, average build. Um, he's clean shaven. <laughs> if his beard grows, it goes ginger, so he shaves it. I mean, not that there's anything wrong with ginger hair. Uh, and bought a photo, they said a spring photo. This was taken last year on holiday in Rome. It's the best one I have. It's the Rockington Arms, the rock. 
It's run by a nice couple, Peter and Susan. There's some other regulars there that Simon likes to drink with. And the barman. It's the Rockington Arms, The Rock. It's run by a nice couple, Peter and Susan. Yes, there's an abstract one. No one uses it for very much. There's a printer so you can write letters on it. Simon sometimes plays games, you know. Simon isn't the type to run off or do anything crazy. Someone must have done something to him or there must have been some kind of accident. So what do we do next? Simon isn't the type to run off or do anything. Simon, Simon Smith. He works at Ernst Brothers Glass. They do windows, all kinds of glass. Simon does the more special work. I'd like to speak to a lawyer now. Please. It's the Rockington Arms, The Rock. It's run by a nice couple, Peter and Susan. No, no one has been in the last few weeks. We had a plumber come in three, four weeks ago. Someone signed with you from the rock. Oh God, I don't know. I mean, I guess the rock. We've spoken to everyone there. Someone must have seen where he went. I don't know. So, it was Friday evening. We had an argument. He left. On Saturday, he didn't come back. I waited all day. He was supposed to go help Eric out with something on the Saturday afternoon. They had a job. He didn't show. So Eric was ringing on the phone. I checked at the Rock. That's our local. They said they'd seen him on the Friday night, but not since. He still wasn't back this morning. It just isn't like him at all. Still not back by dinner time. Well, Eric was like an uncle to him. They were pretty close. They spend a lot of time with each other, especially when they have to go to conferences. Have you met his wife, Diane?
uh, to go to conferences. They were pretty close. They spend a lot of time with each other, especially when they have to go to conferences. Have you met his wife, Diane? Yes, there's a car that we share, a Cavalier, and a van he uses for work. He was wearing um, a shirt, with a blue turtleneck shirt and jeans. He has a watch. It's a really nice one. That was a gift from his boss, Eric. Mm, he had his coat, a long grey duffel coat, like Paddington Bear. Uh, he would have taken that with him. It's not in the house. Yes, that would be in his wallet. It's a visa, a silver one. He doesn't like to spend money he doesn't have, so he usually pays with cash, but Eric convinced him to get one. Yeah, that's Simon's watch. It was a gift from Eric. He got it this year. It was a wedding anniversary gift. Steel. It would have been Diane who chose it. She has really nice taste. That time. You must eliminate me. I was in Glasgow then. Simon and Eric arguing? No, I can't imagine they'd be arguing. I and mean, they get on so well. Unless it was something to do with work. Maybe Simon was being too much of a perfectionist. But I don't know.